don't mind the music, uh, this um, TV, but uh, I got somebody was asking me how to do stand noise, like the man from the stand noise and stuff. And um, for the rear, well, how I got mine is basically I get these little balls right here. These um. It's like a ball. Basically, it's a square ball. But I got one of these little chalk sand or sand or uh, regular uh, brass tubing, which is um, this. You can get it at um, um, how to say a hobby store or a hobby lobby. Um, this stuff is really good. Yeah. Are you having a hole? You see the hole, yeah. And you be needing... So it's, it's like it's styrene and um, this stuff helps a lot and it's really bendy. So, so get a whole bunch of this stuff all the time when I have the time. Then, um, some of my I saw some ideas how I make my A arms, like how I made the ones off my 63 Impala. I used this, then I used this. It's not even that thick neither. You do got pit force mints on it, and I use this. Then to mark my shapes, sometimes I use this like a regular pen. Or, um, this, which is a sharpie. But, um, that stuff, that will actually help y'all. And where I get these from is from model boxes. Like Jay one only was showing me on how how this right here how you got these little small little bitty ones right here the small little bitty ones then you have this big one right here that I cut off I guess a while back or something. Right there, you see that right there, this one? Yeah, I cut off something like this, which was on top of this. And normally you can make, um, can use a drill bit or something like that to um, put a hole like that. But how I cut this off? How I cut that off is by just to find a whole bunch of these at um, some hobby store or you want location Walmart or any heavy, uh, any kind of place where actually do what sells tools and stuff sometimes depending on the place but that's why I get my stuff. Uh, But yes, I do mess with these paints. These, these, some of them's candy. Most, mostly all of them, but depends on what kind of paint you want. Yeah, this right here. You got this tubing. You put the 
A little chain right there. You can get a whole bunch of these. That's another thing I'm supposed to be showing you. You got this little chain with these small little beads right there. And mostly some people use two. Basically that much. Or me, I use three or more. Depending on what kind of car I want it to do. But this right here. Right here. And right here. It's about you glue it right there in that little hole. Put glue in that little hole. Then you go right there. Then it sticks up. Then you put that in from Let me go this right here, and it turns like that. Point the sun on. Then, then you have that. You have your custom made sunward right there. Custom made sunward right there. This is going to be for another project what's coming up soon, so I had to, I had to do one anyways. Uh, let me kind of do something a little bit right quick. And, uh, yeah. Oops. Oh, by the way, um, happy late Christmas to everybody, and um, I should have posted a video, that's how I got that, this Calex, this four-door Fleetwood, something I've been wanting for years, basically I got this for my Christmas present, basically to myself. I bought it. I got a good deal on this. Um, came with the trunk and everything. I just got, I'm mocking it up, working on it, doing body work on it. Because uh, when I got it, it needed. So it's, uh, <laughs> let's say it needed work. Let's say that. It just need work. But this is the stuff I use. This stuff is really good too. It's one ounce, some people use two ounces, but it's a bigger bottle. This is a small, like a medium bottle. But that's the stuff. The stuff which I see these cars hopping in the Cali swinging style. And you got this stuff, what's the hardener? I used two ounce for that one. That stuff is strong. And you want it really nice and good, then you got that. Hopefully soon I get my wire wheels soon, hopefully. Then I can put them on that 63 and call them.
the 446 barrel was available and the 426 Hemi. All of those except the 446 barrel and the 426 Hemi were available even with the three-speed manual transmission. Kind of an odd combination. Equally, that car also was only available as a hardtop. It was kind of interesting. It wasn't available as a post like it came in, so it was like a flip-flop of its original year coming in. Lastly, the wheel opening mold. Couldn't get them on a 68 to 70 growth in a period. 71, you couldn't get one without them. That's just Mopar. That's the boom chakalaka backs that old Mark Warman brings to you every week. So. That's that's how I how I do it. It's depending on how hot, how long you want it is, how long wise you wanted it. As soon I'm about to have to do trimming because um basically this I'm not going super crazy high. This is for some kind of crazy lockup about this high. This is something, but you got your little bar in there. You see it right there. That's how I do my sonar. It's for the back. Like for the rear for this. But I didn't do this build, but that's how mostly some of us do it. It's from the rear right there, you got the little box right there, and you got that. Or, let me show you a Cadillac I was hopping today. I, uh, how you got, my oh bad, how you got this right here, this right here, just like this. This right there, and then you got your Synod right there. That and that's how it raises up back and forward. Then, if you want to put some force in the back, that's how you do it mostly. But I was hopping it too much today and broke it, so I gotta get that fixed. But how I do my front ends is basically like this. Mocked up a yarns. She sometimes get the kit. And homemade top ones as styrene. Uh, yeah, that's, I wanted to show you a little bit of that then. Um, I um, can't hop this one that much anymore because uh, the original switch burn up on me so I gotta get me a new switch for it so um so um soon I uh, need to buy a new switch um hopefully and I got this car this pretty gorgeous one if anyone got the interior and stuff like that, the floorboard and everything, this was a dude's car, basically. I gave him it, but his wife wants to get in people's business and stuff, so, I, so this is my car. I'm keeping it. See? Really super nice car. mine so it's gonna be it's gonna be pretty clean it's a purple plum y'all now airbrush my own cars by the way but if you can come through give me the part uh, the interior board and stuff like that 
I appreciate it. Um, I'll try to help you out, hook you up with uh, any kind of hydraulic setup or something like that. Um, I'm just mostly trying to look for the um, floorboard, the frame, and um, and uh, um, the interior, but that's it. I don't have to have the interior. I just need a uh, floor floor pan, like the interior, the interior pieces, and I need the frame, but that's it. But if you got it, let me know. Hit me up on the bottom of my the um, message, the uh, text, and show me what you got, and um, we can go from there. But other than that, you see the Cadillac. Trying to do that, do the. I got fill little small, small gaps right there. You got, you know what I'm doing. Yeah, I cut the trunk, the trunk uh, thing out because I wanna hinge it up. But you see the cat like detail. Yeah. Got that. Then I got this while I'm doing body work too. Cat like hood, four door cat like and. The, I gotta say, it is a pain of a bitch. Sorry for my language, but to cut all this. But it's a bad cat, like, don't get me wrong. It's a bad cat, like. It's a bad for cat, like. It lays low, lays in place. And. And she's gonna have that crazy nice lock up. That nice, not crazy crazy, but this is how I hide. And she does got the whole trailing arms from the rear, the rear, the arms. The made a arms from the bottom, at the top A arms. She can use for the normally kit. She lays low, 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 low. But I'll be working on that. I got to still. I'm gonna do telescopic on it, so I'm still going through that face on that. But um. Legendary 426 that, uh, you know, I want to kind of, I did, yeah, I know this, perp, this 64, this 64 has a really nice car, so, um, it's a, uh, 2018 build, it's for the 2018 year build, I should have built it a little bit later, but, I can say it's a really nice build. It does have that nice great deep graphics. Into TV has a King mats on it, the blue ones y'all see. Y'all see all that done. See the convertible. That's that's some real stuff right there. Uh, yeah, you see the f that needs to be clean. It's been sitting for a while. I need to start putting them in boxes, like um, the plastic boxes, those display boxes. But I like it. Then you see the this is the cleanest build. Really clean build. Real metal engine. The engine's really metal. It does got the steering gauge to it, so the steering rack. 
So, so you see it. Watch this, watch this, my bad. You see it steers. You see it steers. And yes, it does have hydraulics. It does have hydraulics too. See? She does have hydraulics. She does. She has in her rear. But um, shows you, shows you this car is pretty clean. It's, it's one of my builds too. <laughs> Some people tells me is those one of the other mem or other model builders builds. Nah, I built my own cars. I'm step. I'm just stepping up my game. Very simple and clean, but you see the wires coming through. See that? You see that the holes is little small metal holes in there. See that? You see the spark plug wires. You see all this. See the little solenoids right there for the to raise it up in the front. You see that. I mean, yes, this car does have bar joints, bar joint extension. It's another thing I was going to show y'all. Bar joints. She's a really clean, gorgeous car. She'll be going to the show. Hopefully, March, the Makler show. She's a really gorgeous car. She does have the original 350 in it. Um, the like the real cars have. She has the metal block engine, metal headers. This right here is plastic though, but has all the detail stuff, grammar and stuff. I do need to make me a battery for it soon, cause a car, a no car cannot run out with a battery if it's a if it's a car with charges, no engine. But, I'm about to make a battery for it soon, but this is a really nice, gorgeous car. Really nice. I have that mostly style car, so it had a little bit more detail like that. With the metal engines and stuff. Mostly back when I was a little bit younger. But a little bit, little bit younger. I'm 19, but still. See this? But hopefully soon I get more builds and stuff like that. Oh yeah, I wanted to show y'all this. How about um, you'll see this garage build stock custom or hot rides. Dini, anyone's on? Name one chip what had the doors open. This is a model shop too. The one I build. No one else. First shop. Yeah, I do gotta work on the back. But try to name one what has the open doors. Yeah. It's gonna be nice to see him again. Yeah, first one. Nephew and his wife and uh, the daughter visiting the brought them with us out at this first time up to work. So evil green sixty four. Then you just got to saw um this one. Which is um the purple Shadow, uh, purple Shadow 64 and Power. Purple Shadow. None of no cars in Amarillo, Texas. Is this clean? None. 
And I do got motor in my cars, by the way, too. Not no servo right there, no. Hell no. I play with the motors, real things. Make my car more realistic. My crap is clean. Paint my own cars. I build my own cars. I take my own cars as shows. I don't need nobody's help. I got it. I build. You see that one back there? Yeah, I'm the king, and I'm a little Texas on this. Sure. Living in life, don't have to worry about nobody else except for me. Then I don't have to buy nobody else, no model stuff or have them out no more because it's me, it's my own. So I don't need those people anyway. So got myself. Like, Soon I'm at the look for a model car club. Some people will respect me, what? What will actually? What will help me out and stuff? What will? Um, when people are trying to change how your cars look and stuff like that. And Change what kind of glue and crap bullshit. Nobody's not going to change the way how I do my shit. Get off my fucking level and move on. But King, no one cannot stop me. No one. Especially in Amarillo, Texas. King of this build game. Real engine. All my cars have engine. This hopper. Hopper. Hits this high. 24-7. 24-7. Engine. Chrome shit, bro. Chrome shit. Real detail AMs, too. AK from Sean Hustle. My big boy from Sean... Oh, big boy, Sean Hustle. Appreciate it, bro. From that and Brett for the spill. Uh, I break anybody off with this. Here's some the those those three. Soon I get more. The king of the North Amarillo, Texas, uh, everywhere in Amarillo, Texas. King of King. But I really appreciate to my subscribers and thanks for the people, thanks for the people what just what prescribes and um, soon I'll be making more videos of the, the real talker right there. Talk is cheap. Name of this car is real talk. Eighty. Ninety six Fleetwood. Only one in Amarillo, Texas. Only one. No one else. And same for this one. Even though people got six floors, not clean as these. 
not clean as that even is, which is my 70 Impala. This is mine. There's people don't know how to get out of my fucking business. Look at that. Boom. Looking shiny and clean. Woo! Call that one purple magic. Throw a little fairy dust on that stuff and make it look like that. Hey. Real talk. Saying we out. Peace.